Sailing the high seas used to be the only way people could travel to far-off lands, but it was almost always a dangerous expedition. People took their lives into their own hands when they set off, and they simply had to pray for safe passage. These days, however, traveling on huge ocean liners is much safer than it used to be. Yet disasters can still happen, no matter how big and modern a boat may appear. A few years ago, thousands of vacationers set sail for what was supposed to be a truly luxurious experience. Everything was going fine until one command from their captain changed everything. In 2012, the Costa Concordia left its port in the Italian town of Civita Vecchia. Everything seemed normal, but the 4,200 passengers and crew were headed for disaster, and none of them had any idea. Though modern ships like this one are typically safe, this vessel never made it to the next port. Instead, the Italian cruise ship struck an underwater rock just off the coast of Isola del Giglio, Tuscany on January 13, 2012. Following the disaster, which resulted in the deaths of 32 people, the Costa Concordia remained mostly underwater until September 2013, when it was brought back into a fully upright position. After that, camera crews were finally able to explore the damage inside. The never-before-seen images that were captured were completely breathtaking. In the wreckage of this beautiful theater were the remains of a once fabulous entertainment space. That's rather standard on cruise ships these days, but the idea of enjoying a show before suddenly confronting your own doom in such a nice place is horrifying. This particular room looked like it had been burglarized, but it really just shows how violent and chaotic the wreck was. In as frightening and desperate a situation as a shipwreck, there are few limits to the sheer destruction. The few surviving passengers said that the shipwreck was like a scene from the film Titanic. After all, many of them drank and played in this casino mere hours before the deadly disaster took so many lives. From there, it just became more eerie. This lower deck room hadn't seen sunlight in years before the ship was finally uncovered. It's amazing what kind of things can happen when something that had been lost for quite this long finally sees the light of day, literally. The crew of the ship used to work in these halls, but just look at them now. It was a miracle that anybody could have survived this wreck at all, and pictures like this one prove how utterly remarkable that kind of survival really is. Many of these beds were never even slept in, since the deadly disaster happened so soon after the ship embarked on its journey. It's sad to think that what was meant to be a fun, relaxing vacation for so many people ended so tragically. Bags and suitcases still littered the hallways, along with the memories of those who survived this event and those who were lost. Whether or not they ended up surviving the ordeal, everything had to be left behind on the ship. The photos from this disaster are every bit as haunting as the photos we've seen of the Titanic's wreckage. Hopefully, all of the survivors can cope with the trauma. Please share this chilling story with your friends below.